Welcome to the channel, dear knights and friends. Today we shall delve into the wisdom of medieval philosophy. The medieval era, a period spanning roughly from the 5th to the 15th century, is often characterized by its profound philosophical explorations that intertwined faith, reason, and knowledge. Medieval philosophy flourished in a context where religion and theology were intricately linked to the understanding of the world and human existence. Within this context, philosophy played a vital role in exploring the relationships between religious faith and human reason, as well as in the pursuit of truth and wisdom. One of the striking features of medieval philosophy was the ongoing dialogue between philosophy and theology. Where many thinkers sought to harmonize the truths revealed by faith with those discovered through reason. The philosopher and theologian Thomas Aquinas is often remembered for his efforts to synthesize Aristotelian thought with Christian doctrine. His masterpiece, the Summa Theologica, stands as a testament to the attempt to unite faith and reason, arguing that faith and reason do not contradict but complement each other in the pursuit of truth. In addition to Thomas Aquinas, other notable medieval philosophers also played a significant role in exploring the wisdom of this era. Augustine of Hippo, for instance, brought the influence of Platonic thought into Christian theology arguing that true wisdom is found in God. His works, such as Confessions and City of God, reflect his desire to understand the relationship between the earthly and the divine. The debate over the nature of reality and the relationship between universals and particulars was a central issue in medieval philosophy. Realists like Anselm of Canterbury believed in the real existence of universals, while nominalists like William of Ockham argued that universals were merely mental abstractions without real existence. This debate resonated through the centuries and influenced the subsequent development of philosophy. Beyond theological and metaphysical discussions, medieval philosophy also addressed ethical and political issues. For example, Aristotle's work, Politics, rediscovered and translated in medieval Europe, influenced thinkers like Thomas Aquinas and Marsilius of Padua to explore questions of justice, governance, and the relationship between the state and the church. Medieval philosophy was not merely a period of theoretical speculation. It also saw the development of important educational institutions, such as medieval universities, where knowledge was preserved, transmitted, and debated. The scholastic method, characterized by rigorous arguments and logical analysis, became a central approach in both teaching and philosophical inquiry. Central themes of medieval philosophy, faith and reason. The relationship between religious faith and human reason was a central theme of medieval philosophy. Medieval philosophers often sought to reconcile the truths of faith with logic and rational thought. This effort to harmonize these two domains resulted in a rich tradition of debates on how faith and reason interact in the pursuit of truth. Metaphysics and realism, metaphysical questions, such as the nature of reality, the existence of universals, and the relationship between form and matter, were widely discussed. While realists argued for the real existence of universal concepts, such as humanity or truth, Nominalists maintained that they were mere mental abstractions. These discussions had a lasting impact on the development of philosophy. Ethics and morality. Medieval philosophers also explored ethical and moral questions, often anchored in religious principles, the pursuit of virtue, the nature of good and evil, and the relationship between action and intention were frequent topics of debate. Philosophy of mind. Medieval philosophy explored the nature of the human mind and its relationship to the body. Questions about the nature of the soul, cognition, will, and free will were debated in relation to both theology and psychology. Schools of thought in medieval philosophy. Scholasticism. Scholasticism was a philosophical method that emphasized rigorous logical analysis of classical and religious texts. 
Scholastic philosophers often used logic to explore complex theological and metaphysical questions, seeking to arrive at clear and well-founded conclusions. Christian Neoplatonism Influenced by the thought of Plotinus, Christian Neoplatonism explored the interconnection between the divine, the material world, and the human soul. Philosophers like Augustine of Hippo and Boethius adopted elements of this tradition to explain the relationship between God and creation. Medieval Aristotelianism With the rediscovery of Aristotle's works, medieval philosophy saw a fusion of Aristotelian thought with Christian theology. Philosophers like Thomas Aquinas sought to synthesize Aristotelian ideas with religious doctrines, resulting in innovative approaches to philosophical and theological questions. Influences and Legacy Preservation of Knowledge During the Middle Ages, monasteries and universities played a vital role in preserving and transmitting classical knowledge, including Greek and Roman philosophy. This allowed future generations to build upon the legacy of antiquity, development of education, the establishment of medieval universities, such as the University of Paris and the University of Bologna, promoted formal education and intellectual debate. The scholastic method influenced how knowledge was approached and taught. Impact on modern philosophy. Many debates and themes from medieval philosophy continued to influence later thinkers, including Renaissance and modern philosophers. The discussion about faith and reason, for example, resurfaced during the Enlightenment era. Medieval philosophy is a captivating chapter in the history of human thought. Its efforts to reconcile religious faith with reason and the pursuit of truth have had a lasting impact on the evolution of philosophy and on the relationship between knowledge, religion, and culture. Exploring the wisdom of medieval philosophy allows us to understand the complexity of human inquiries and the constant quest for deep and meaningful answers. In summary, medieval philosophy is a rich tapestry of thought that developed in a context of faith, reason, and the pursuit of truth. It reminds us of the importance of exploring connections between different fields of knowledge and of seeking harmony between faith and reason. Medieval philosophers have left us a legacy of profound intellectual debates and an unrelenting quest for wisdom that continues to inspire and influence philosophical reflection to this day. If you're new here, I invite you to subscribe to our channel and become a part of our roundtable of wise nights. Thank you, and until next time.